said, excuse me, coach, but there's no football. And Coach Graham said, right, how many men are on a football field at a time? Somebody said, 11 on a team, 22. And Coach Graham said, all right, and how many people are touching the football at any given time? Well, one of them. And he said, right, so we're going to work on what those other 21 guys are doing. <laughs> and that's a really good story because it's all about fundamentals. Fundamentals, fundamentals, fundamentals. You've got to get the fundamentals down because otherwise the fancy stuff isn't going to work. You know, if I'm working a hard problem, people will see me wandering the halls with one of these things. And that's just because, you know, when you do something young enough and you train for it, it just becomes a part of you. And I'm very glad is we send our kids out to play football or soccer or swimming or whatever it is. And it's the first example of what I'm going to call a head fake or indirect learning. We actually don't want our kids to learn football. I mean, yeah, it's really nice that I have a wonderful three-point stance and that I know how to do a chop block and all this kind of stuff. But we send our kids out to learn much more important things. Teamwork, sportsmanship, perseverance, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And these kinds of head fake learnings are absolutely important. And you should keep your eye out for them because they're everywhere. All right, a simple one, being an author in the World Book Encyclopedia. When I was a kid, we had the World Book Encyclopedia on the shelf. Uh, for the freshmen, this is paper. 